Alrighty, so we got to figure out what the heck we were doing the last time we played. Uh, it's been about almost a week since we last played. It was last Tuesday. Um, today is Monday. Um, so I've been pretty busy. Didn't really have too much time to stream. Um, but that's okay, because we're, we're here now. And hopefully we can get in a good session today. So um, we had about... 20 minutes ago, we were having some technical issues with OBS not wanting to stay connected and be stable. Um, I did a speed test and everything is fine on my end. Um, I reset my stream key a couple of times, reset servers a couple of times. And so far, so good. So um, if there's any drop frames in the coming videos, um, you know, just let it be known that it is sort of unstable. Um, for whatever reason. Definitely is on Twitch's end, for sure. Um, but, yeah, so, we're gonna get started here. Um, I'm gonna keep an eye on the bumpers and everything like that. Um, so what the heck were we doing the last time we played? Uh, let's take a look here. <clears throat> All my friends have off switches. We were doing a lot of quests in that. Um, we actually did, um, I think an antenna quest the last time we played. Um, looks like X8, we're going to be able to do two quests in one. So we really only have four active quests right now. We're looking for missing modules for the light switches on the jukebox, or in the jukebox, and apparently they're in Higgs Village. Uh, Higgins from Swan Song. So we're going to go ahead and go into there. Um... But yeah, I think I think we're gonna think we're gonna be good. Um, I cannot repair that with anything. Do I have a weapon repair kit? Uh, I do not. So we're either gonna have to make one or just find one somewhere. Um, we really do need to upgrade this weapon. Um, but first of all, we're gonna go into here into Higgs's village. Whatever is gonna be in here, I don't know. Whoa! So this is basically inside a hangar. That looks really awesome. Be a good thumbnail. Uh, okay. So what is our weapons here? That is our um, AR-14. Um, two is ammo swap, three is stim packs, four is that, five is the big dog. Um, we'll use this for now. Um, so let's take a look. See if there's anything good in here that we want. <clears throat> take those. Was there a stair down here? I didn't even notice. No, okay. Interesting. For whatever reason, there's basically a neighborhood inside a hangar. <clears throat> they got grass in here that grows and everything. Nothing good. I don't care about picking up a carton of cigarettes to sell. Rolling pin. Lol. Okay. Do, do, do. Whoa. Um, so apparently the light switches uh, will probably be in one of these houses. So we'll just start from here. Zero, one. Do they actually have numbers on there? One on one. Okay, cool. What is this one? One on four. <clears throat> so I think we'll go um, counterclockwise here. Um, we'll do this house and that one and then that one. Let's see what's going on. Pretty flowers out here. Door zero. Zero. Look in here. Oh, a Securitron MK1. Uh, I don't need any of that stuff. Turn on our light here just to look.
There's a speaker there. Okay, so I don't see anything. I'm going to turn the light off to keep the spooky, ominous feel. Oh my god. Uh, who is this man? Is that Liberty Prime behind him? I'm pretty sure that's Liberty Prime. I don't know who that is. They got him right in the groin. Possibly the worst spot to stab a man. Uh, got anything good in here? I don't want any of that stuff. Very interesting. We're going to leave those knives in you, by the way. Uh, my name, what's up? Online Matilla, what's up? Both of you guys, that is Mr. House. Wow, okay. I, uh, completely went over my head, but thank you for, guy for that, guys. It's good to have you guys here as well. <clears throat> Mr. House and Liberty Prime. Interesting. Okay. Let's check the top floor in this house here. Let's see what we got. Got a lot of dead Securitrons in here. Uh, Jesus. So much tech in here. Why is there a generator in the bathroom? What happens if a man is peeing and... For whatever reason, you know, stuff happens where you get shocked and stuff. <clears throat> but we'll save that room for the last here. Uh, a bunch of books. I want to know what's behind this mattress. Give me the good stuff. <clears throat> Haven't seen my stream in a while. Yeah, I, I was... Uh, pretty busy. I only streamed one time last week uh, on a Tuesday, and it was like for like two hours, so. Um, but we should be good uh, to be able to stream all days this week. As long as OBS doesn't crash or do anything wrong, you know. Um, we should be able to do it a full week. Uh, Museum of Technology? We were there in uh, Fallout 3. That's pretty cool. Audio sample, giant tarantula. Okay. That's not a terminal that I can get into. Interesting. Bunch of tech. Yeah, found a recalibration file for the sonic emitter. Take it to the jukebox in the sink to recalibrate the sonic emitter for new effects. <clears throat> awesome. So, is that part of that quest, then? Huh. Well, actually, no, that's something different, then, that we just found. Let's take a look at this. A uh, giant tarantula attack can be used to modify the sonic emitter weapon at the sink jukebox. Okay. Well, we're in here to find the sink jukebox uh, hollow tape or module, or whatever you want to call it. That's cool. Okay, so this house is done. Beautiful neighborhood, if I say so myself. Uh, I would live here. But you're living in a hangar, so it's like... I don't know. Oh, yeah, what do we got on tap here? Fish bra pale ale? Mmm. Sunset sarsaparilla? That's a... Dirty Barnster's Brown Ale. Okay. Uh, what does that say? Uh, Horowitz Lager. Dunwick's Irish Red. Uh, I think I'm going to have... Uh, I'm going to have Brown Ale. I think that's what I'm going to have. How do I have Brown Ale? Please. If I just uh, put my cup here and it just automatically fills. Good. <laughs> Got 
Got a bunch of whiskey down there. I don't really want to take all that stuff. Uh, take a look over here. Nothing up there. Dinner plate. Oh, what's that underneath there? I think that just might be a ruined book. Actually, nothing is in there. <laughs> the floor kind of looked like a ruined book, so I wasn't sure. Pressure cooker. Um, nothing there. Okay. Bottom floor is clear. Let's check the top. Because all the best stuff is in uh, the top floor. Take all of that. Someone had wine in the tub. Okay. Probably should be sneaking like a little bit slowly so I don't miss anything. Uh, what do we got in the wardrobe? Nothing good. Dr. Klein scrubs. Almost 6,000? Uh, yes. I will take that. I don't really know who Dr. Klein is. It could have been... Is that one of the the robots? It might be one of the robots. Oh my god, there's someone's hand underneath there. Dr. Klein's glove. Sync Project Book Shoot. Oh, ruined books? Or pre-war books, maybe. Probably pre-war books, I would think. Um... Okay. Nothing good there. It sucks these terminals aren't on so we can, like, read stuff about what the heck's going on in here. Uh, okay. This area is clear. Move on to the next house. Where there's a skeleton with the camera outside. Perfect. This is going to be a great one, isn't it? I thought I had my pit boil on, but it turns out it's not. Move that up. Okay. What do we got in this house here? I'm gonna go this way first. Uh, I don't really want Nuka Cola. Don't want that either. Care for that. And the light on in here. Bobby pin. I didn't mean to grab a metal cooking pot. that in the stove. Okay. Let's check this area over here. Booster. Oh my god, there's like a mainframe up in here. Okay. <clears throat> Let's see, anything good in the desk? that. Just little things here and there. 26 bottle caps. That's the most we've seen. Recipes. Science skill book. Uh, that's kind of cool, but I already have max science, so I don't need that. <clears throat> A Nuka-Cola lamp. You know, Bethesda should really, like, sell something like that. They would, uh, totally make tons of money off that. That there. 
There's a lot of Mentats everywhere. Too many Mentats. Anything hidden? Nope. Alright, so besides the science book recipe... Nothing else in here, I don't think. Um, yeah, I think this house is clear. <clears throat> so we got three more houses to check. Where's the button at? There it is. Do we need to drink alcohol? Uh, let's see. Yep, we do. We need to drink some whiskey. Does that take away the thing? Yes, it does. Okay. Save it, and let's go into this house. House 103. <clears throat> okay, a house that's not trash or anything. This is nice. There's got some cages here. <laughs> they have a little swing in this cage for like a bird to sit on. That's kind of funny. Ooh, we got a basement here. With a very hard lock. We'll definitely be checking that out. Uh, anything in here? Air bomb, switchblade. It's definitely the birdhouse for sure. Let's go upstairs before we go down. Okay. There could be a key in here to unlock that with, which I would be okay with. It is a very hard lock. I'm going to take these pre-war books because we might be able to do something with the book shoot uh, that we now have. Medicine skill book. I could use a medicine skill book. Dino toy, sure. There's a knife there. We looked in that already. Anything over here? Any safes underneath the bed? Foot locker there. Very cool. Uh, we'll take that. Alright, let's check the uh, basement here. Got a really hard lock pick, so let's try this. it up a little bit like right there nope okay it's gotta go down a little bit more I think oh crap okay <sighs> well I mean we have you know 200 bobby pins so I think we'll be okay I think we need to go to the right a little bit more let's do that and start going up a little bit There we go. Sometimes you just gotta break it a couple of times, and then you'll just get it correctly. So we do have a workbench in here. Microfusion cells, nice. Definitely need that. Whatever was in here, just... That's scary. Oh no! Teddy! He's in a cage and he's got knives sticking out of him. As well as a syringe, because apparently he likes drugs. <clears throat> I'm sorry, Teddy. Empty syringe. There's a ripper there, we'll take that. The ripper is one of my favorite um, melee weapons in the Fallout universe. One of my favorites. That's an empty syringe. 
What does it take to make a weapon repair kit? Um, let's do some recycling microfusion cells, which is only two, which is stupid. Satchel charge. Um, what makes a weapon repair kit? Scrap metal, duct tape. Apparently it won't let me see. Wrench, wonder glue, scrap metal, and duct tape. Okay. Let's see if we can find any of that stuff here. I think we already have scrap electronics, so we don't need that. Duct tape, wonder glue. Nice. Now we just need scrap metal. It's there. Uh... Oh, we need a wrench. That's the last thing that we need. Uh, okay, so let's keep an eye out for a wrench. Is there a wrench in this toolbox? Uh, okay. Derp, there's a wrench right there. Alright. Weapon repair kit, please. So we'll keep an eye out and see if we can get any more of that stuff. Because I do need to repair my sonic emitter weapon. Um, we'll keep an eye on for that. Do, do, do. Is there anything over here? I don't think so. Nope. Okay. Can I just like grab you out of here? Ugh. Grabbing the knives out of you. Cause you deserve better, Teddy. I know you do. All right. Um, well, we gotta take that. Okay, so it's good to know that there's a workbench down here. <clears throat> Just remember, uh, house 103, please. Okay. The lunchbox there. So this is the house that has the lighting switches that we need. Let's take a look. 108. 108, boys. So we dropped, what, six more frames at some point, which isn't too bad. Uh, if it gets really bad, I'll just have to use the uh, local recording uh, as a, um, uh, for like, for YouTube and all that. Take the pre-order books, just in case. Uh, Dinner plate. Wasteland omelet. Sure. Well, oh, that's there. Brown, brown, brown. All right, my name. Thanks for hanging out, dude. We'll see you next time. All right, let's go check up here. That was knives in the wall there. Eh, one bottle cap. Everything seems to be working on your end? Okay, cool. Yeah. I mean, five frames, no one's really going to be able to tell. Uh, with five drop frames, honestly. Uh, but it's good to know that everything's working well on your end. Because we had a little bit of a rough start. We had about 20 minutes of me fiddling with settings and stuff like that. Um... But like I said, I, I think it was 100% a Twitch uh, issue, so. Um, Sync Project Jukebox. There we go, that's what we needed. Find the missing modules for Toaster, Muggy, and the Book Shoot. Okay, cool. So we got those three to keep looking for. I think we'll uh, keep doing that. Oh, come on. <clears throat> Pre war money, okay. Uh, opera singer audio sample. 
Not too sure what that's for. We found a recalibration file for the sonic emitter. Take it to the jukebox in the sink to recalibrate the sonic emitter for new effects. Okay. <clears throat> so we're de that's the second one that we found today. That's good. Uh, okay. So we'll just uh, make our way out of here. We've got one more house to check, and then we're pretty much done in here. Uh, and then we'll figure out what we want to do next. Um, whether that be, it probably will be, um, continuing to find the, um, what is the thing called? <clears throat> the missing modules, which will make us go to, wow, they're all over there? Okay. So we kind of got to go far for that then. Okay. Alrighty. Let's go check this. Hipster dog, thank you for the host, man. Appreciate it. How are you doing, man? I don't need scrap electronics. So we're good there. Duh. <laughs> I don't know what the purpose of all these bears were, but, uh, okay, speech skill book. Don't need that. Dude. Pre-war hat. Eh, I don't need it. Do, do, do. Yeah, somebody whoever whoever's house this was really enjoyed fashion. Tons of hats, tons of different clothes. Kind of funny. Yeah. <clears throat> All is well, just streaming and working. Hashtag the daily grind. That's it, man. <laughs> Someone's gonna have nightmares about all these teddy bears. Uh, I think that's about it. So let's go ahead and get out of this house. We'll do a little bit of looking around the surrounding areas here. But I think we're pretty much done in here. Uh, and then we'll go check that other place for... Missing modules and such. Um, any ideas on what your next game is going to be? No, I haven't thought about that at all yet. I would say we still have maybe at least 30 more hours of Fallout. Um, I would like to, to maybe finish this up by next Thursday if I could. Uh, with that being said, I, I don't, I'm not going to rush or anything like that, but... Um, I think we got maybe like <clears throat> maybe like another four or five hours in this DLC and then we're done. So but we'll see. Have I seen We Happy Few? Yes. Um, I saw that game at announced at E3. Um, but what? Oh my god, it's a mini death claw. Um, but that game is early access. I, I, they never said anything about early access at E3. Um, so, and for me, I'm not really a fan of early access. I don't really buy into that, to be honest. Um, I'd rather just wait for games to be finished. But from what I understand, there's not too much story stuff in the, the early access build. It's basically just to show people how the game works. So, uh, but I, I will definitely be playing it when the game fully releases. It's just unfortunate that it's early access. I didn't think it would be. If he hits me, does he just one-shot me? I don't know. Oh my god. Dude. Looks crazy. It does look interesting. Uh, it basically gives me a really like heavy Bioshock vibe, which I'm a fan of Bioshock. 
Jesus, dude. How does he do that? He's so small. He's the smallest Deathclaw I've ever seen. <clears throat> Unbelievable. All right. <clears throat> we are going to bring out the big guns for this. I don't even know how. Is there any drugs that I can take? Turbo. Hmm. Damage plus 25%? Sure, we're doing that. <laughs> yeah, I think we should be okay. Let's try, um, let's try it this way. Whoops. All right. Come here, you tiny death claw. Just gonna. I'm gonna go for your legs. Bros, we might have to come back this little guy. Why is he so... Why is he so difficult? <clears throat> Alright, I've got one thing that we could try on him. Um, this would be the only thing that I could try on him. And then if so, we're gonna have to come back. This is insane! And also funny at the same time. Yes, misfortune! Oh, he's definitely crippled. Get crippled, boy. Thank God we got misfortune. Yes! Take it. Take it, Strike. You small little bastard. Okay. Deathclaw hand. Uh. Sure, why not? By the way, that death claw is an Easter egg, really? It's not Wild Wasteland.